Time and time again, we have shown you that by pushing the levels of cordless technology, we can get more out of our M18 system, making the inconceivable a reality. Next up, something I doubt you ever expected to see on an 18 volt system. But of course, Milwaukee is doing it. The first ever M18 fuels 14 inch abrasive chop saw. Eric Onsager joins us now for a trade talk about this incredible feat in cordless technology. I'm excited to be on site today talking with Kevin about Milwaukee's new M18 Fuel 14 inch abrasive chop saw. So Kevin, you want to get us started by telling us a bit about what you do, how long you've been in the industry? Yeah, so I'm a commercial contractor and I've been doing it for about 15 years. Awesome. All right, so let's jump into this tool. Would you mind telling me a little bit about what your impressions were about the power and performance of this tool? This saw has been able to cut anything that my corded saw has been able to. For 18 gauge studs, which are a little bit heavier duty, sure. we've been able to cut about 30 to 35. That's awesome. And how does the speed of cut compare to your corded? They're right on par for each other. So whatever my corded one can do, this saw can do just as well. And now what about the versatility of this tool? This tool we can take anywhere. In some of our hotels or any of our industrial applications, we've been able to take them from one end to the building to the other, cut studs, and then not have to intrude on anybody with any type of quartz. Now every time we come out with a new solution, users always ask, what's the runtime? So you can talk a little bit about uh, what you've experienced with the runtime in this tool and what battery pack you use? Yeah, so we've always been using the 12.0, and then for our 20 to 25 gauge, we cut them in bundles, and we've been able to get about 200 studs per battery pack. And how much of a day's work is that? That's about four hours worth of cuts for us. So about know. half a day yes. on 112 yep. That's great to hear. Are there any other features on this saw that uh, you found beneficial as you've been using it? Yeah, one of the things that I really like is the keyless chuck. Over time, the Allen key gets lost or somebody rounds out the bolt that actually goes through. So having a keyless chuck for us has been beneficial to just take it off and pop on a blade. That's awesome. I'm glad that features really hit home with you. Any thoughts on the rapid stop break and how that might have changed how you use this saw? Yeah, to see it actually in this saw has been great for us. Just another safety feature that we like, aside from being cordless, so we're not having to drive around cords. That's great. So we've added a new feature on this saw, which is our indicator light. How has that helped you and your guys? Yeah, the indicator light lets us know that, you know, we're going, we're bogging down the motor and ultimately the battery. So over time, you know, you, you kind of learn to work with the saw as you're mm. going through your cuts. That's great. Thanks, Kevin, for agreeing to talk with us today about this saw and give us your thoughts and feedback on it. I've really appreciated your time today. Thank you. I appreciate it.